Happy birthday, Baby K. The family of Kaor Baby K. Stevens gathered at her grave Tuesday afternoon to celebrate what would have been her third birthday. It hurts just coming here and having to celebrate it like this, but that's all I can do. And I just think about my baby every day. Katira Stevens describes her daughter as bright, intelligent, and independent. Baby K's grandmother says her personality already stuck out, even at 11 months old. She would just scream so loud with laughter, and it would just make me giggle. It always brightened my day, just her smile alone, just hearing her laughter. And that's what I'll miss. Baby K's life was cut short in 2021, just two days before her first birthday, when her skull was crushed by Bryce Caesar, a former boyfriend of Katira. Her grandmother says she lost two people that day. Her mom. A part of her, I, I saw it literally leave her body that day. Just watching K.R.'s mom and dad have to shop for her last fitting on the week that we were supposed to be looking for her first birthday outfit. Baby K.R.'s mother says the loss is indescribable. I feel empty and I'm heartbroken. Like, I'm so heartbroken. I don't have my other piece. Like, that was my first, my first born, and I don't have her no more. He played as if he wanted to be someone to help her. Instead, he was the one to hurt her. Caesar was sentenced to 30 years in prison on Monday. He faced up to life. It's a peace of mind, but it's still kind of a burden, you know? He took a life sentence from me, so why you can't serve a life sentence? The family remembered Kayor at her grave and at home, saying she will always be in their thoughts and Caesar's sentencing is a good start for healing. To hear my daughter say that she feels a relief and that she can breathe now, it gives me strength. I don't want to forget her. I'll never forget her. That's my baby.